isn't life on Earth wonderful? We enjoy life on Earth and look after it with the help of lots of satellites. They work just above the Earth in what scientists call low Earth orbit. Let's go and take a look at what's happening there. Why do you need to take this orbit? I need to be here to observe the Earth and track its health. And that's very important. And I need to help some people with their internet connection. This is very important. Uh-oh, it's getting a little crowded here. Many very useful satellites are in low Earth orbit, which is pretty close to us. Humans send them here because you need less energy and so less rocket fuel to place them here compared to farther out in space. But above all, these satellites need to be close to Earth in order to do their jobs, like taking pictures of Earth or connecting people who live in isolated areas of the world to the internet. Hey, be careful, you hit me. I've completed my mission, but I can't come back to Earth by myself. Help! Oh no, this situation is getting out of control. I need help to sort this out. Wait, perhaps we can do something to improve this space debris jam. Can't we use some kind of tool to grab these satellites and bring them back? Maybe a net or a robotic arm. Perhaps one of these types of satellites can help remove out-of-service satellites and broken pieces, this space debris, by guiding them safely to Earth. Oh, now that's better. Many of the satellites in space can't deorbit and return to Earth at the end of their missions without help from other satellites. Can you think of tools that could help satellites deorbit themselves? Engineers and scientists are testing drag sails, which are like ship sails, to slow satellites down so they can fall toward Earth and disintegrate or burn up in the atmosphere. This way they leave the space free for other satellites without causing any damage back on Earth. But this only works for small satellites. What do we do with the bigger ones? Larger satellites need more help. They could carry extra fuel in their tanks, enough to send them back to Earth. Or even have extra motors that switch on at the end of their mission that push them toward the ocean. Hmm, all this makes me think that we need to keep Earth orbits as clean as possible from space debris so that all our satellites can work at their best. We also need to take care of Earth in every way possible, my friends. We need to find more eco-friendly ways to lift our rockets and to design and build our spacecraft so they continue to protect Earth without contaminating it. You can also help protect Earth by reducing, reusing and recycling. Today, we've learned that Satellites orbiting Earth can help us by studying our planet and connecting us to one another. There are many old satellites and broken pieces of them called space debris orbiting the Earth that can harm active spacecraft. Tools like robotic arms or nets may help remove out-of-service satellites from orbit. Designing satellites that can return to Earth on their own is a great way to keep space free of debris. Building eco-friendly spacecraft is important to protect Earth without contaminating it. You can also help protect Earth by reducing, reusing and recycling. <laughs>